Welcome back, Maz Bad Party People. Coach Anderson here, and if this is your first time watching, welcome in. So we're gonna go ahead and get to this word problem here. That's about a linear equation. So if you wanna give this a try and pause the video real quick, go ahead and do so. But otherwise, I'm gonna get started and show you how to get things done. So first things first, my party people, we always wanna read the question first, every single time. And the question says, how many videos did Thomas watch? So clearly this video, or this problem, or video as well, but this problem is about a certain person watching videos and we wanna know how many videos this person consumed. Okay, cool. So really now the point here is to, again, read the question first so we can dial into the information. All I care about now is the number of videos that Thomas watched and any information that's related to the number of videos that Thomas is watching. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and read through the information, remembering that again, we just care about videos. Videos equals blank. That's all I care about. So when I read through the information, Thomas's phone battery consumes 4% of charge for every video he watches. If his battery began at 55% and ended at 35%, how many videos did Thomas watch? So here's what I'm gonna do in this video for you. I'm gonna show you two ways to solve this problem. One, I'm gonna show you a very intuitive way that'll make sense to anybody. But then number two, I'm gonna show you how to do this by using y equals mx plus b to show you how to organize it super smoothly, give you a nice boost of confidence and lower that test anxiety. So before I begin, as a reminder, if you like the way that I teach, please give this video a like, consider subscribing to the channel, that way we can reach more people just like you. So here we go. We wanna know how many videos, Let's dive on in. We see that it consumes 4% for every video. So I can write that as, you know, a negative, right? It consumes 4% of charge for every video. So pretty much what that means. So 4%, so we're going down 4% per video. What else do we know? We know that Thomas's battery began at 55, ended at 35%. So pretty much what I want to know is how many times can we take away 4% from 55 getting down to 35? That's really what's going on. And if that didn't make sense, watch this. Again, we start at 55% right here. This is where we started. We ended at 35%. So here's what happens. If I take away 4%, where do I end up at? 51%. If I take away another 4%, that's 47%. Another 4%, that's gonna be 43%. Take away another 4%, that's gonna be 39%. Take away another 4%, and that's gonna be 35%. Why did I do it that way? Well, because remember, every video means 4% of the battery charge goes down. So how many times did we take away the 4%? That's gonna be one, two, three, four, five. Five instances where the battery went down 4% to get down to 35. That means that there were five videos watched. Five instances, that means five videos. And again, that's an intuitive way to solve this. And again, that's gonna get you B, but let me show you the more straightforward way. This is gonna help you understand how to save time when it comes to similar problems just like this. And I can guarantee you, about 75% of the problems that you do when it comes to the ASVAB can be written in some way, some form or fashion is y equals mx plus b. So here's the second way we can do this. We can simply use, again, a, a linear equation, y equals mx plus b, knowing that the y is the end result, your b is the beginning, and then your m is your rate, and your x is gonna be basically the number of events. Typically, that's going to be time, so five minutes, 10 minutes, 50 minutes, whatever. Um, or it could be, in this case, since the rate is the percent per video, well, that means, again, percent per video, that means X is the number of videos. Remember that your rate, your slope, your rise over run, that's going to be your Y over your X. So percent per video, X is the videos. So right there, this is what we're looking for. And I know what, ha what I have at the end. I have a battery charge of 35% at the end. I'm losing 4% per video, so that's minus four. Your rate is negative because you're going down 4% every video. And we started off at 55%.
So how do we do this now? Just solve the equation. Solve the equation and you are done. And as a reminder, my part of people, this is unit number six in the arithmetic reasoning course in your ASVAB account. So if you're in my program, again, you can find tons more questions just like this with step-by-step -step solutions, lessons, guided practice. And if you're not in the program and you'd like to try the program for free for a full week, just go ahead and text TRIAL to 833-321-0182. Just text TRIAL, have a conversation with my robot there, and it'll set you up. So here we are. We'll go ahead and solve this now, nice and easy. Minus 55 on both sides. That's going to give us negative 20 equals negative 4x. Don't be afraid of negatives. All you have to do here at the end is go ahead and divide both sides by negative 4. And we have x equals negative divided by a negative is positive. 20 divided by 4 is 5. So same way, but notice how this is a much more straightforward way because we didn't count on all of this over here having to go ahead and count down by 4% until we got the actual answer. We got lucky that it was a short method here, but what if you know it was 25, 30, 35 videos? That would have taken forever to show. And that's why it's so important to know your formulas, know your concepts, because you'll be able to solve problems with much more confidence. So again, I'm Coach Anderson. If you like this video, go ahead, leave a like, leave a comment as well, and consider subscribing to the channel. That way you can get more up-to-date free ASVAB videos and more free help every single week. Again, love you guys. Let's ace the ASVAB and I'll see you in the next video. And as always, my party people, thanks for watching. You can subscribe with that button right there, and you can also see a link to a video just like this one right up there. But most importantly, if you want the program and you want to raise your score the right way, every step of the way with my support, there's that link at the bottom left. Go ahead, click that link, watch the video on how the program works, subscribe, and raise your score.